Hi oh YouTube. Whoop, just gonna move my mic forward a little bit. There we go. Hi oh YouTube. My name is Dexter and welcome back to Hollow Knight. I don't really know where I'm going, I'm just kind of going. I also have no idea how long this game is. So we might be here a while, we could be here like seven episodes. Who knows? I don't. I could ask my friend who how long this game is, but I don't want to ruin the surprise. What's over this way? Probably nothing good, admittedly. What are you telling me? Can I inspect that? It looks like some kind of dinosaur skull. Eh. Eh. Oh, I think I know exactly where I am, actually. I think I think I know where I am. I'm somewhere near the, uh... <laughs> Excuse me! I'm somewhere near the, uh, boss fight room. I'm pretty sure that's where I am. Let's see what's in here. And how badly I'm gonna get my ass beat. What are you telling me? A toll machine with the symbol of a stag. Insert Geo? No. So I gotta pay to fight bosses? Okay. Oh! It's a fast travel station. Okay. The last stag. Greetings, little one. It's been an age since I last heard the ringing of a station bell. It echoed down the stagways and called me to you. I've grown stiff and tired over these many years, and I've forgotten much, but the sound of the bell will always call me back. These stagways stretch the depths of Hallow Nest. If you want to travel them, hail me from the platform. I will take you where you need to go. Well, that's kind of disappointing. He's the last stag beetle in existence? Wow, that's sad. I feel sorry for him, but that is the stag way. I like it. <clears throat> I was kind of expecting it to be a boss and <clears throat> excuse me. Uh kind of expecting it to be a boss in all honesty. Wap, wap. I guess I'll heal up real quick. Maybe there's more to do, I don't know. Maybe there's more bosses to find. Or more things to find around here. <laughs> oh good heavens, what are you? You look like a boss. You definitely hit like one. I'm thinking the idea is I want to be above him. Thwap, thwap. Well, I'm dead. That's not good. First of many deaths. Okay, so I... Uh, uh, uh. Dirtmouth, the fading town. Did you visit that temple? A very strange building I've heard, and though I... Though I'd never dare the journey myself. The braver among us once went there to pray, so they felt at peace within the walls. After a while, they stopped going. I wonder what changed. So, I have a broken spirit meter now. Does that mean I have to get back to my body? Hello. <sighs> Couldn't buy a map, have you? It's really my husband you should be dealing with. But what a surprise. He's headed down below. He'll pop back occasionally to deliver new maps for the store, but I wish I do wish he'd spend a little more time up here. I have not much interest in retail myself. Now, let's see what there's here for me to sell. Wayward Compass, I have no money. A quill, you'll need this if you want to update your map with new areas as you explore. These pins will bend, will mark benches and other rest spots on your map, useful if you're exhausted and just needs to find somewhere to sit. Have you seen those beautiful blue cocoons? I've made these pins so you can keep track of them. The cocoons are pretty, but very delicate. Please be careful around them. Vendor, Stagway, Hot Spring, Scarab. What are Scarabs? Uh, and a shell. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, so I need to get back to my body wherever I die. That's an interesting mechanic. I like it. Definitely very Dark Souls-esque. I'm going to slide that back a bit. I guess I'm going to put it back where it started. Uh, can I... Can I mark? Do I get to see where I died? Yes, I do. Okay, so where I was was not the boss. Gotcha. What happens if I die before I get back to my corpse? Does it is it like Dark Souls rules where I just don't get that stuff that I had on me back? I'm okay with that, but I just want to know. And apparently the faster way to get back there is going through this old ass temple. Or going by this old ass temple. I'm okay with that. 
I also just like breaking stuff. I have a very, very real disregard for others' property, I guess. It's not true in the slightest. I just like breaking stuff in video games. Get out! Get out! Reek! <clears throat> I wanted to say leave me alone, but it started coming out as re. So I guess I'm just a filthy, uh, filthy casual. How would I get up there? Oh! I probably could have used that to bounce off of it. Okay. Even though there's really no point for me to be up there. So... I'm past the egg temple. Do I want to go in here? No, I don't think I do. Oh, look at that. I slapped the dude into... Ow. Into the stalactite that was going to fall on me. Good job, me. I didn't realize that was a thing I could do. Uh, I have no clue where I... Okay, I think I know where I am. I'm near that hump area. But I don't know exactly what where that is. Get out! <laughs> so this is not the way to where I was, but I definitely like murdering things. So we're going to keep doing it. Um... Yeah, I have no idea where I am. I'm just gonna go back. I'm gonna see. If, I'm gonna see if I can get back to my corpse, whether or not it is still there. I'm gonna see if I can't get back to it. But <clears throat> as it stands, even though the very first challenge that I came across beat my ass, I still had fun with it. What are things down this way? Probably nothing good. I have no idea where I am right now. Oh, I can't even go this way. Okay. <laughs> I'm not not too surprised by that. In all honesty, I'm not surprised by that in the slightest. I don't want that geocache. What is over here? This is certainly a new area. And I don't think I want to be there. Can I not go down that way? Okay, I gotta go all the way around. Damn. Or maybe I just don't realize where I am and I'm completely lost. But I'm pretty sure I'm underneath the big egg temple there. Uh, could be wrong though. I don't know why I did that. <clears throat> I'm gonna see if I can't get back to the egg temple so I can figure out where I am exactly. Okay, so I'm at the temple. I'm at the big stag temple, and I want to go... Uh, you know what, now we'll just go the long way around, friggin'. I'm pretty sure that locked door that I was at earlier is where I'm supposed to be. Uh, or was the, uh... Was the way down, but I can't go down that way because it's locked on me, so... We gotta go this way! Can I grab that with my sword? No, I cannot. I can grab it with my face, though. So we're going all the way around. All the way around town. I also like how everything resets every time I die. Even Well, I say reset, but all the items reset is what I mean. And I wonder what that broken... I wonder what happens if I die again. Do I get a more broken... Uh, symbol? More broken Hollow Knight? I hope not. Whee! So, going even deeper underground. It's a great idea. Now I gotta go this way. I'm gonna see if I can't sneak past the giant guard, too. Oh yeah, you shoot stuff at me, right. I thought you were gonna run at me like that other big dude. So what do we got in here? Oh, it's a hot spring. Okay. Not entirely certain what the hot spring does for me, but it's a hot spring. And a uh, bench to take a rest at. Sweet. 
Good to go. Good to go. I mean, I didn't have to sit down here at all, but we're good to go nonetheless. <coughs> Excuse me. So we're going to press onward this direction. This away. I would love to be able to air dash. But I don't... I don't know if that's a thing I can actually get, or... I know you can get a dash, but I don't know if it's an air dash or not. I know I want it. I definitely, definitely want it. Whoops. Didn't make the jump. There we go. But yeah, it feels good playing platformers again. Uh, although... My time playing Mega Man X has, uh... Alerted me to how trash I've gotten at them. But I guess that's what happens when you don't play them for the better part of like 10 years. You tend to forget how they work. Boink. I really like that mechanic. The ability to bounce off enemies. I... Pogo sticking my way around enemies is always a thing I'm gonna enjoy. Now, was I... Did I go this way? I don't... Yeah, I definitely went this way. I definitely went this way. So... No, I'm not gonna be- oh crap, that hurt. I'm not gonna be able to get all the way up there. But I can go this way. So this was the stag way. Or damn close to the stag way. Thwap, thwap. I can't get up there. But I can get back to my souls, or my, 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 my body, wherever I died last. I'm pretty sure I'm really close to it. I'm fairly certain it was over here. Yep, there he is. Oh, I gotta kill it! Okay, I gotta kill my own body. Excellent. I like it. Ow. Don't land on me. I just got in here, damn it. <laughs> Don't kill me again. <laughs> I figured I'd just have to pick it up, but nope, I gotta kill myself. Sweet. I'll just pop that again real quick. I, I don't want to be missing health. So where... Why do I feel like this is a boss fight room? I also have no clue where exactly I am. Hey, big guy. Ow. Not a super big fan of this. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Not a super big fan that I can't, like, cancel those guys' attacks by hitting them. Oh, hey, big guy! False knight. Come on, jump again for me. Thank you. Oh, okay, that's got a big shockwave on it. Understandable. Have a nice day. Hup. Eh. Are you dead? You're about to be. I like your big head, though. Let's just sit here and heal up, shall we? Hup. I didn't jump in time. Ow! Stop that! Okay, so that's not... Okay, so his giant leap slam does not have the shockwave after it. That's just his regular slam. Down you go, big dude. I don't know what exactly your head is supposed to be, but I'm gonna hit it a bunch. And I'm gonna heal up real quick. I don't suppose I can break those little things, can I? Oh, let's get away from that real quick. I would very much appreciate having a dash of some variety. Be able to get underneath his giant hammer swing. Or get away from his giant hammer swing. Dash underneath him. Do anything that dashes are known for. Instead of just having to walk back and forth. I also want your giant hammer, big guy. Can I have that? I know I don't actually get anything different than my little dinky sword here. But I that doesn't mean I don't want his giant hammer. Alright, third time the charm. Rule of threes, is that how this is working? Better bl Nope, not the rule of threes. Okay. 
So we ain't quite done here. Sweet. Oh. It is the rule of threes. Maybe I shouldn't be doing this to him. Maybe I shouldn't have killed him. But we did it anyways. Falsehood. Achievement unlocked. What are you? City Crest. Okay. Sweet. Can I have his mace? Please? Oh, a bunch of money. Sweet. Hell yeah. Oh, his mace... <laughs> his mace was a giant beetle. Where do you think you're going? I ain't done with you yet. I didn't say you could leave. <laughs> okay. I guess I'm just bullying people now, aren't I? Alright, you can leave. See you, Mr. Beetlehead. Mr. Beetle Mace. So that was fun. That was a boss beaten. First boss down. I don't know how many more to go, but we beat a boss. Cool. Now, where exactly am I going is the next question. Do I want to be up there? That seems pretty evil to me. Seems pretty voodoo-esque. Let's go into it anyways, I guess. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, -ho! who was that creeping out of the darkness? My, you're looking grim. A strange empty face and a wicked-looking weapon. Snail Shaman. Something important has drawn you down into Hallow Nest's corpse, but I won't ask what. Perhaps the reason you found me is because you need my help? Say no more, friend. I'm going to give you a gift, a nasty little spell of my own creation. It's just perfect for a little one like you. Oh, ho What are we doing? Okay, what do we do with it? Boop. All right. Oof. I guess I black out. Consume the vengeful spirit. Tap B to unleash the spirit. De spells will deplete soul, replenish soul by striking enemies. So I have a ranged attack now, I guess? Where am I? Oh, you've woken at last. I apologize. Perhaps I should have warned you about the power of that spell. I was watching over you as you slept, but it seems to have slipped, but I seem to have slipped away myself. Now you're awake, I was wondering whether you would do me a small favor. Not as pay repayment for my gift, of course, simply because we're now friends. You see, a horrid great beast has made its home in the heart of this temple. Such disrespect. I would be quite grateful if you were to venture deeper in and slay it for me. It's a hardy creature, but with your new power, you're more than a match for it. Good luck with the small favor, my friend. I feel like I may have made a terrible mistake. Wow, that's strong. Okay. Ancestral Mound. Get out, Roller Beetle. You remind me of a... Oh, what, what was that Pokemon called? Scallopede? Uh, Whirlipede and... Yeah, Whirlipede. It was Whirlipede, Venipod, and Scallopede. Wap. <clears throat> Just a lot of Pokemon. A lot of the enemies in this game remind me of Pokemon because they're all bugs and there's a lot of bug types in Pokemon. Not nearly as many as water types, but there's still a lot of bugs. Bam, get out. <clears throat> oh yeah, I gotta break, gotta, gotta do jumping strikes. Although I can swing my sword straight down. No, I know I can't. I can't swing my sword straight down if I'm standing on the ground. That was a lie. Whap, whap. Hey, 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 hold up. Now, I know the idea is that I'm supposed to jump over all of those roller bugs, but I'm not doing it. I'm killing them. I'm killing every single enemy I encounter, and I hope I don't get a bad ending like in Undertale. Which, isn't the isn't the, the, the bad ending like the true ending, or am I thinking of something different, or is that the true pacifist ending? Is the true pacifist ending the true ending of Undertale, or is it the like the canonical ending of Undertale, or is it the, uh, the, 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 the genocide run? I don't know. Do I want to jump down here? Probably not. Oh, wait, I'm down here now. Thwap! Thwap! Can I... I can't steal spirit from you by hitting you. Oh, okay, you're gonna give me little roller bugs to hit. Cool. I like it. Come back and me, roller bug. Thwap! Ow! Stop it! Eh, eh. There we go. I killed them both. Hey, what's this? Soul Catcher. Equip a charm to activate its powerful abilities. To equip charms, open the charms menu while resting at a bench. 
Okay. I feel like that'll give me more soul for doing things. Oh, so it's done then. You've slain the beast. The poor thing, it must have been terrified of you. It used to be quite docile, but the rancid air in these caves filled with some ancient rage. Still, you did what had to be done. You have my gratitude. Of course, we both know you wouldn't have made it through without my, that spell of mine. Can I? Okay, thank you. And look, the gate's been opened. Ho, ho, ho. I'm sure you're eager to move on. Farewell and have faith. Whatever you're seeking, it will find you. Doesn't exactly fill me with... Doesn't exactly fill me with, uh... Oh, whatever the words I'm looking for. Used by shamans to draw more soul from the world around them. Increases the amount of soul gain when striking an enemy with the nail. Oh, is that my weapon? I just have a big nail? Okay. I mean, I know it's like the nail as in something's claw, but I want to dream that it's just... I'm hitting people with a rusty nail. Did I want to jump down here? Probably not, admittedly. I have no real idea of where I'm going. But I'm going to call this an episode. For those of you who are new, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to. But if not, then carry on your merry way. But for the rest of you ramblers, I will catch you all next time where I will be doing I don't know what. I haven't really figured that out yet. Maybe I'll go back and kill the big dude. Hey, what's this door? What's this do, rather? It's not, I mean, it is a door, but I don't know what it does. Hey, Corn Effects' glasses. Sorry if I missed you. If you're feeling lost, why not pop up to our store in Dirtmouth and purchase a map of this area. Available now for an excellent price. Cornifer. But okay, yeah, I'm gonna go. I hope you all enjoyed this, and I'll see you all next time. Bye, everybody. It's been a ton of fun. I don't really know what I'll be doing next time, though. I don't know if I actually finished that statement or not. But yeah, I have no idea what I'll be doing next time. But bye, everybody. It's been, it's been fun.